Hey everyone, it's been so long since I made a video last. Uh, I've had a very, very busy end of the semester and I've been off doing many other things, but it is summertime for me now. I am um, on break from school, so I will have more time to film and upload more regularly. I was doing lots of things. I was in a musical theater production. Uh, it was an all original musical that my friends wrote, composed, came up with everything. We were in that and um, my friend Rylan taught me how to do theatrical makeup for that, so that was really fun and very exciting. Um, I was in a recital with my music fraternity, Sigma Alpha Yoda. That's what my last video was all about. I soloed in that. I am not a singer, you guys, but I thought I would do that for fun. So yeah, I've been really busy um, doing a lot of things, but now it is the end of the semester, so I'm just so relieved. And today I have a haul for you guys. This is a collective haul that um, was done over a period of time. I did not buy all these things at once and a lot of these things I bought at work. I work for Walgreens. Um, I bought them on sale with a coupon so yeah I just accumulated a lot of things. But I did stop by CVS with a couple of my friends and I was just really curious to try the Milani Brow Shaping Clear Gel. I have no idea if this is good or not. I have never heard anyone talking about this ever, <laughs> but I need a brow gel and I was just curious to try it. I have used it like once, that's why it's open, and I really like the brand Milani, so I figured, hey, why not? And the one other thing I got from CVS was the NYC Expert Last um, Lip Color, and the color I got is Forever Fuchsia, and I have only worn it once. I am really drawn to bright pinks like I cannot get enough of colors like this so that's why I wanted to try it. and then I was with my friend Claire she um she's a very good friend of mine Claire Kamenis she always watches my videos and she is a very 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 talented um designer and artist and photographer and so many other things so we went to Claire's together Claire and I went to Claire's and I decided to get some ear care solution because I um, usually have problems with my ears being sensitive to certain metals um, pretty much everything my ears are sensitive to almost every these are the owl earrings I got I just think they're oh I just dropped one that's what these owl earrings look like and I think they are so cute these ones that look like ribbons. Um, it was like a buy two, get one free type thing. And then I got this set. I think this has one, two, three, four, six pairs. And I don't know, these are just kind of my style of earrings and I really like them. So that's what I got at Claire's. Now for the Walgreens stuff, um, I regularly watch Holly from Holly Eats Lipstick and I just really like her recommendations. Her reviews are so thorough and I just, I'm addicted to her channel. She's awesome. And she talked about how she's been enjoying these which are like the Walgreens brand of the EOS lip balms so I got the blueberry blue raspberry one and the strawberry one and they smell really good without being like too fruity if that makes any sense at all uh, two ones that were on clearance was the Revlon color stay I got this one in black is black and the covergirl professional all-in-one mascara I haven't heard a lot of things about these so I'm kind of mm, about it but I mean it was on clearance you know, and this, um, I've heard good things from, uh, about this from Melissa Raymond. I think she talked about this melps her channel. And now this is the voluminous full definition. So anyways, I got this in black is black. I'm kind of excited to try it. It was on sale. Used a coupon, got it for like $4. I have really, really been loving the Vaseline lip therapy. I finished up the one in cocoa, the cocoa butter one completely. I love that one. The regular one, the original is actually okay for me. I like the cocoa one better, but I thought I would try the rosy tinted one too and another thing that I really like it's very moisturizing and very comfortable to wear is the Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick so I got it in the color Fresh Papaya it is the Revlon Colorverse Lacquer Balm I got it in the color Vivacious number 120 this is what the Revlon Lacquer Balm looks like that's Fresh Papaya right there it's a real sheer neutral color Rimmel 60 seconds nail polish on my Instagram um, a few weeks ago. I think it was in this color Which is Sweet lavender and because I like this formula so much. It's so fast. It dries so quickly just like the claim says 
Um, and it almost kind of solidifies a bit. Like I messed up one of my nails when I when I painted with this, and it seemed to just solidify and kind of like fix itself. It was very strange, but I guess it has to do with the dry fast formula. So I picked up some more just because I wanted to try more of them. Here's the other colors I got. This was on clearance. I know I really like this line. Um, I see it going on clearance at Walgreens, so I hope it's not being discontinued altogether because I really like this formula a lot, but I picked up um, the color Bold Sangria since I thought it might be my last chance to get it. Since we're talking about nail polish, this is what I'm wearing on my nails today, the Essence Color and & Go, and the color name is LOL. I know that's like really kind of silly, but <laughs> I think it's cute, so whatever, right? This is the CoverGirl Blast Flipstick in the color Flashy. This is the berry shade that's on the Blast Flipstick, and right there is the pink shade. It's like double-ended. And yes, I cannot get enough lip products in my life, so I um, got this color Stormy Pink, which is a matte shade by Revlon Super Lustrous. I have a ton of these. I absolutely love this lipstick line. No, the staying power is not incredible, but I really like the color range that they have and the formula. I just really like it. It's pretty moisturizing. It goes very smoothly on the lips. I love these. So I got Stormy Pink. And yeah, you can see by the swatches on my hands that I love bright pinks. It looks kind of similar to that NYC one. That's Stormy Pink by Revlon. This is the Maybelline Dream Lumi uh, Highlighting Concealer Pen in the shade Radiant. I believe this is a similar product to Radiant Rose Highlighting Pen by MAC. I've never tried the Radiant Rose one myself, but it seems to be a similar concept. Um, this is a repurchase for me. I went through one of these already, and I really, really liked it for highlighting underneath the eyes in that kind of triangle type motion. And then the last thing that I have is a limited edition eyeshadow quad by the Wet n Wild Fergie Center Stage Collection. This shade is called No Filter. That's what they look like on my fingers, so pretty impressive there. Those, uh, those are the shimmery shades that come in the palette and then the matte brown. Now, so far, I haven't actually worn this on my eyes yet, but so far, this cream shade that comes in the quad does not seem very impressive at all. But I do like the other shades, so I'm excited to... Um, do a look with this. So that is it for my collective beauty haul. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!